While on a bicycle tour of Holland, Miss Mallet, the world-famous detective, took a wrong turn. She became separated from the other cyclists. When she dropped back on the right road, the tour group was nowhere in sight. All day, Miss Mallet pedaled hard and fast to catch up, but she was still way behind, and she was so tired and hungry. Finally, she decided to look for a place where she could eat and spend the night. Soon, she came to an inn. Miss Mallet parked her bike in front and entered the inn. The inside was very gloomy with dark woodwork and furniture. Everything lacked color, even the flower vases were empty. Oh well, thought Miss Mallard, it will do for one night. She signed her name in the guest book. I'll pay for the room now, Miss Mallard said to the innkeeper. I'll be leaving quite early in the morning. I'm hoping to catch up with my tour. Your room is the first door to the left as you go upstairs, said the innkeeper. As she handed her a tea. Supper is now being served in the dining room. Miss Mallet went up to her room and unpacked her knitting bag. Then she went to the dining room. There she met another guest at the inn, Julia Pintail, who invited Miss Mallet to sit at her table. I'm so glad to meet you, Miss Mallet, said Julia happily. Your name is known all over the world. During this during supper, the two of them chatted about their travels. Miss Mala told her about visiting the pyramids in Egypt and the canals in Venice. Miss Pintel had been down Amazon River and to the, to the top of Mount Everest. But all the while, Miss Mala noticed that her dining companion was very, very nervous. Julia kept glancing at the dining room entrance. From time to time, she took a small black book from her purse and scribbled a few words in. Suddenly, while having their dessert, two tough-looking ducks appeared at the dining room entrance. In a flash, Julia ducked under the table. Pretend I'm not here, she whispered to Miss Mallet. Tell me when those two ducks leave. Miss Mallet waited. She saw the two ducks look around the room, then they vanished. It's safe to come out now, said Miss Mallet to Julia. Julia came out from under the table and said, Do you think they saw me? I can't be certain, said Miss Mallet, as she noticed the two ducks walking through the lobby. What is this about? I can't trust you because I can't tell you because I trust you, said Julia. But you must tell no one else. I am a secret agent. In a client's bookshop in Amsterdam, I accidentally learned that a ring of smugglers has its headquarters in this area. They are smuggling stolen diamonds. China and all master paintings out of the country. She paused and said, I'm positive that those two ducks are part of the ring. They have been following me everywhere. They are hunched ducks.